फॉलोइंग डिफरेंट कैपेसिटीज आपको ये स्क्रीन नजर आ रही है इस वक्त मुदारे बैच फॉलोइंग डिफरेंट कैपेसिटीज की यस सर यस ओके यस सर सो मुदारे बैच फॉलोइंग मुदारे हैज फॉलोइंग डिफरेंट कैपेसिटीज 1 2 3 4 5 यू आर लुकिंग हियर इट डज नॉट मीन दैट एट द सेम टाइम दीस फाइव capacities exist in mudarib no okay let's let me discuss it first of all number 1 amin mudarib is amin how he is considered he or she will be considered amin or the trustee the money given by rabbul mal and the assets required therewith are held by him as a trust because when rabbul mal gives money to the mudarib what is the reason he is going to give his money because he trust upon his skills he trust upon his character he trust upon his truthness so that is why he is giving him giving him his money because he consider him amin trusty so that is why sharia says that mudarib also plays the role of trustee for him so it means the money in his hand provided by the rabbul mal is as a trust and and other dimension of the trust is that that if the loss if the business faced loss then the rabbul mal will bear the uh, loss financial loss and in case of amana in case of trust you know that if trust amana is lost be, because of any natural disaster then amin is not liable hum jiske paas amanat rakhwate hain aapne amanat rakhwai thi amanat kisi arth ko ek zalzale ya kisi wajah se ya koi daku ghar mein lutere aa gaye us wajah se wo luti gayi to kehte hain amin is baat ka zimmedar nahi hai कि जिसके पैसे उसके पास अमानत के रखे हुए थे वो उसको अपने अपने माल से उसकी चट्टी भर के उसको जुर्माना भर के वापस करे नहीं वो उसके पास अमानत थी उसकी जिम्मेदारी नहीं है हाँ अगर उसने उस जिम्मेद उस अमानत को जय करने में नेगलीजेंस बरती तो फिर उस नेगलीजेंस की वजह से अब उसके ऊपर लाइबिलिटी बनेगी तो सेम एज इन मुदारबा दैट इफ देर विल बी नेगलीजेंस इन लॉस ऑफ trust and loss of the capital provided by rabbul mal then the mudarib will be at the loss if there is no negligence and the loss was because of any natural reason then mudarib will not bear any loss so in this way mudarib will be considered as amin so it, that is why we say that mudarib plays the role of amin the second one is wakil agent because whatever mudarib will buy whatever mudarib will invest it will all decision he will make those decisions will be considered on the behalf of rabbul mal whatever he will purchase that will not be owned by mr mudarib that will be owned by rabbul mal then it then in what capacity mr mudarib is buying and selling something we will say that in the capacity of agent of rabbul mal so one dimension of mudarib is that he is wakil or agent of rabbul mal on his behalf he or she run the business of mudarib so that is why his capacity is also wakil capacity sharik partner because he or she share the profit with rabbul mal mudarib share the profit with rabbul mal so because of sharing the profit we can say that they are partners rabbul mal and mudarib are the partners d zamin zamin damin damin not za damin liable दौद के साथ आएगा जमानत जिसको कहते हैं ना आप उर्दू में हम दामिन लाइबल 
when he or she will become mudarib will become liable if there will be any negligence or the conduct or uh, misconduct by him and there is a loss then he or she mean mudarib will bear the loss he will be liable so that is why then he he or she will become zamin damin ajir ajir mean employee the person who will get ujrat the person who will be who will get wage when mr mudarib will be considered employee because otherwise he is not employee otherwise he is partner with rabbul mal he will share the profit he was not he will not get any wage but he will get the wage when if mudarba becomes void due to any reason then mudarib is entitled to get a fee for his services for example if mudarib was restricted to run business in islamabad by rabbul mal i for example i as a rabbul mal restricted mr bilal that i am giving you this money and you will invest it in karachi rather than making doing business in karachi bilal starts business in lahore and face loss then mr bilal as a mudarib he violated the condition of mudarba so it means that that contract was void mudarba that contract was not mudarba he violated the conditions now uh, after one month mr bilal earned some profit so the sharia says the question is that what would be given to the bilal whether we will give profit to the bilal or we will give some other thing to the bilal the sharia says that because he violated the conditions uh, necessary condition because he was restricted to business in karachi uh, but he did not uh, run the business in karachi and he started it in the lahore so that is why this violation says that that the mudarib uh, mudarba contract was void the, then when the mudarba contract is void now sharia says that we have to determine that capacity what and what capacity mr bilal worked for one month the sharia says that we will consider him as a employee of capital provider hum ye kahenge ki wo uske mazdoor ki haisiyat se uske naukar ki haisiyat se uske paise ko invest karta raha uske hal karta raha so what amount will be given to the mr bilal the sharia says that we will we, we will we will look at the market that what wage is given to the person who do this type of business jo business usne kiya hai us tarah ke business ki kya ujrat di jati hai that ujrat will be given to the mr bilal usko hum profit nahi denge kyun denge isliye ke ab wo uh, that is no more mudarba contract because he violated the condition 